Philippe, I'm interested in learning a little bit more about your role here at Tornos. What do you actually do? I'm heading the product management for the Swiss type machine and I'm also in charge of the uh, MedTech market worldwide as a segment manager. So what is the Swiss type machine? Talk to us about the range and, and, and where it starts yes. and where it finishes. So today Tornos is uh, offering uh, over 15 different types of machines, kinematics. We have solutions uh, for entry level machines, so simple applications, simple parts mid-range for uh, mid-complex applications and uh, high-end machines like the Evodeco machines here, uh, which we sold already uh, more than 10,000 machines worldwide. So we today cover uh, all the customers' needs in the different market segments like uh, medical, dental, automotive industry, electronics and micro-mechanical applications. From a UK perspective, Tornos has always been very well known for its multi-spindle machines. That's the other half of the business, isn't it? Actually, actually, Tornos is selling, and is, this is also one of our strengths, different type of machines, multi-spindle for high productivity machines and single spindle machines worldwide. So let's have a look at this, let's talk about this machine behind us, for example, what, what have we got here? Yeah, this is an Evodeco 32, very famous kinematics for high productivity and feasibility. So for example, you can have a look at the parts we are manufacturing here. So this is a part for the hydraulic industry, for the chemical industry made in stainless steel, 316 LVM, so you can see that this part needs uh, high cutting forces and cutting speeds. And you can see something much smaller, which is an egg-linked dental implant for the medical uh, market segment. So you can see that Tornos cover all the market needs from bar size one millimeter up to 36 millimeter today. So this is a great way of seeing the types of applications that Tornos get involved in yes. and the diversity. But what about your machines themselves, the models we're talking about, the Swiss machines? Where do the strengths lie? What's good about them? Okay, so actually I have good two samples to show you. Evodeco machines, for example, so we have up to four tools in the cut, so we can get a very high productivity on the machines. And if you look at the small parts, angulated abutment, it needs a lot of milling process using up to five simultaneous axes, meaning process. So you see highly complex parts, small parts, and big ones parts where we need heavy cutting uh, speeds and feed rates. So what Tornos are essentially looking to do with their machines is obviously reduce non-cut time, isn't it? Get the parts off the machine as fast as humanly possible. Yes, absolutely. So this is uh, very important. So we, we are looking for productivity, highly precision, part complexity, we also have very productive solutions for simple parts where the cost per piece is very important for customers. Therefore, with our uh, uh, product portfolio, we offer also not only productivity, feasibility, but price that match to the market needs. This is interesting because in, in the UK market over recent years, we've seen Tornos sell more machines uh, at competitive prices to the subcontract market. How have you been able to do this to, to get your prices more competitive yeah. on the machines? Uh, this is a, a good question. Actually, we are focusing also to develop our different markets, USA, Europe, of course, but a lot in China. You know, China market is a market which is still increasing versus uh, European or American market. Therefore, we decided, and this belongs to our uh, strategy, to start manufacturing an assembly of machine in Taiwan, Taichung, and in China, in Xi'an, by Tornos companies, where we have Tornos people, also Swiss engineers working there, also people for the quali quality from Switzerland that are looking for a very good uh, quality of assembly. And if we are in China and in Asia, this is also uh, to be able to reduce the manufacturing cost because, as you know, it is a very sensitive market concerning price of the, of the machines. So there's no compromise in the product that's coming out of China, though? There's no difference to what you may produce here? No, absolutely not. Uh, also, very important to say that the, the key components for our machines that we do assembly in China and in Asia are coming from Tornos, Switzerland. For example, uh, spindles, main spindle, sub-spindle, guide bush, rotating guide bush, which are the, the heart of the machines, are manufactured in Switzerland and shipped over for the final assembly. You, you mentioned earlier about 15 products within the portfolio. Yes. Let's talk about, very briefly, about the DT and the GT. Where, where do those machines fit? Yes, so DT are, uh, we call them entry-level machines, so simple kinematics up to five axes. 
Uh, GT machines are machines with a six to uh, seven axis. We can also offer on those machines the B-axis, for example, for this angulated abutment. And the uh, high end is uh, occupied by the Evo Deco with 10 axis, and also now by the brand new uh, Swiss Deco concept we just show at the MO uh, Hanover two weeks ago, where we see also a very uh, inter a big interest from the market. Are you developing new technologies on these machines all the time? We are also looking, of course, uh, to develop uh, not only the mechanical side of the machines, but also the electronical side of the machine, speaking about, for example, industry uh, 4.0, uh, which is very common now. So we develop a lot of software. We are developing also on existing products uh, some specific macro for our customers. We just show at the Emo show uh, what we call the ACB. This is an active cheek breaker solution. So helps the customers by using a very uh, simple macro to to uh, to master the size of the chips they get in the machines to avoid avoid uh, long chips and uh, issue with chip management. Is that available across all the Swiss machines? It is available on all the Swiss type and also on the multi spindle machines. If you took year on year, let's say the last five years, a Tornos selling more machines now than they were five years ago in your area? Yes, absolutely. So we are very successful in a kind of a niche market, for sure. But also we are very successful now in other countries where Tornos in the past was not able, you know, to sell so many machines as we are today. Now we have really, you know, a price of machines that's matched to cost per piece by our customers.